So what's up guys? Today I'm gonna to be talking about my tires that I got for my car. I got the Continental Contact DWS06. I got two of them for my front wheels. So when I first got in the car, or when I first started driving it, the ride felt smoother. So I thought it would be the opposite but it felt smoother and it turns out like I didn't have the correct air pressure in the tire. It was like low, it was at 30, I think, but for only one tire for some reason. So, I'm, and then when I filled it up, it didn't feel as smooth, but that could have been just me getting used to it being smooth. Like, I don't know how unsmooth it is. I should have put this in a different spot. I can't see. Um, I don't know how, I might have gotten used to it being smooth that I don't feel like it's that smooth anymore. Like I wanna put my other tires on, but I don't wanna put my other tires on just to do that, waste the money. But yeah, it felt smoother, but that's not what I like was concerned about. I was concerned about the grip. So I got them two months ago, it's December now. So it was starting to get cold out. It was literally like that week, it was like starting to get cold. So it was like 40 degrees maybe. And I was so excited to try them out and dual launch and the wheel still spun a little bit not a little bit it spun a lot depending on what i did but i was hoping for them just to hook up now i'm hoping that was just because um they were it's cold out so the material isn't like warmed up so it's not at its fullest potential um, It's so weird because I don't know what like if my car feels like with no wheel spin in first gear, and I feel like it should be faster than how because sometimes I would get it and it wouldn't spin or I didn't hear any spinning. But also second gear, it like cuts my boost, which is annoying, and I feel like that causes it to not spin. But if I like launch it from second gear with traction control off, spins. First gear, ooh. I'm sliding everywhere. It's just screw, and I don't want to do that because I feel like I'm just destroying my tread. And um, new Max is nice, by the way. So, uh, but yeah, they they do have more grip now. What I'm really impressed by is the wet grip. So wet grip, 9.5 out of 10. It feels like it almost feels like. The wet grip is as good as my old grip on when it was dry. Like on my old tires, the grip while it was dry, it feels like that almost. Like I can turn, like you don't understand how better it feels to be able to turn and like accelerate at the same time while it's wet out. Now I know clearly like a lot of cars, they spin, like my Altima spun, spun the wheel spun. But like since this car had so much torque, like I mean like accelerate the tiniest bit on brand new tires, like it was like, it was unbelievable and i was like scared to turn because like i would like you know how sometimes a car is coming really quick and you just got to turn and, and, and go i couldn't do that so i would do that and spin and i would end up being slower by accelerating so wet grip way better i can like actually and i can not only turn and, and uh, accelerate but i can accelerate straight too way way more which i'm 100 percent impressed by um I mean, they're all season tires, so high performance all season tires, so that's what I should be getting, right? Anyway, um, the next thing I noticed is turning feels way better. So before turning, like it felt like the, the, the tires were like pushing me back, like no. Now it's just like, yeah, we're gonna turn, fine, that's okay. And you might be like, what? I don't, that's the best way I can explain it. Like it was kind of like resisting and it was just, it turned it didn't feel good now it feels way better it literally like my car handles way better and like honestly uh mazda should have put these tires on the car from the start like this feels like what the car should feel like and anyone who has a mazda 6 even if you don't have the turbo i mean if you're worried about grip then you should get these but just i don't know how, i don't know if it's the same tires falcons on the uh, lower trims but definitely get these tires I 100% recommend them. They are a gift from heaven if you're coming from the stock ones. 
Uh, I don't know why. I do not know why Mazda put up put these tires on or the Falcons on this car because they do not suit the car at all. And I guess it was a savings thing and maybe fuel economy. Maybe I mean the same size tires, so I don't think that matters. But yeah, definitely like these tires. So like I said, still wheel spin, so I wasn't happy about that. That was the one thing I wanted, no wheel spin. But I'm I'm hoping it's just because it's cold out. Also, because it's cold out, my car is faster. So colder air, more dense air, so more oxygen per amount of air pulled in compared to when it's hotter. So my car, like you can tell, it feels significantly faster. Probably like 10% faster. Like It feels more than that, but I don't know. I, I, it definitely can't be more than 10% faster. It being faster and the tires being colder was, is not a good mix for acceleration. So um, another thing, I'm getting my car tuned. So if I get this thing tuned, this, these tires definitely won't suit it. So I'm going to get summer tires uh, in the summer, not just because just, I'm just gonna, I need time to save up money and all of that. So I will have a video on that too. See how this thing does with summer tires. And the ones that I'm getting, the I think the Michelin Cup Fours, they have very good ratings and everything. So I'm I'm excited to get them. Uh, I love the sound of my engine. Um, yeah, so I'm getting those. So I'll have a, a review on them. And I know I'm going to need them if I actually want to put all the power that I'm going to get from this tune. Yeah, so I just want to do a quick review on these tires because they're wonderful. I need to spread the word, get these tires. There's also another pair of tires that I that was rated. These are like the, on tire rack at least, these are the second best tires to get for my car, um, for my wheel size, I guess you could say, for high, ultra high performance all season tires the other ones were like Pirelli's or something like that I forget but they're a little bit more expensive and I kind of wish I got them but these are good too I'm happy with them um so who knows maybe they would have better grip I don't know but I can tell you for a fact these are are good these are worth the money um yeah so that's gonna be it for this video uh I know I haven't been making videos posting videos in a long time i've been working crazy peak i've been doing i've been going to school homework and all that so i will start to post more and also like if i'm not doing anything to my car what am i gonna post videos about actually that's a lie i have a bunch of ideas of videos i want to do that's not technically including this car um so yeah thanks for watching peace All right, guys. Oh! No. Oh no! This this thing can't be doing this. Hold on. Oh, I'm spinning it the wrong way. Righty tighty. <laughs> oh no! No, not the windshield wipers.